The Red Lake Tribal Nation is facing unprecedented population concerns following a recent study by Wilder Research. Due to current blood quantum requirements, a person must have at least a quarter Red Lake Nation blood in order to enroll for tribal membership. And this could cause a drastic decline in members in the next century. These guidelines for joining the sovereign nation are put in place not by the tribal leaders, but the United States government in order to, to determine important provisions for the tribe. But some members, like Tribal Secretary Sam Strong, say these requirements are harming the Red Lake people in more ways than one. It's important that we have our identity, and for those members that uh, fell below that one quarter blood quantum and still do, some may still fall below it, um, we're holding them back from really embracing their own identity, from understanding that knowledge of self, and really helping them understand how to uh, not only be successful in today's world, but to deal with the issues that we're faced with as Native people. The way blood quantum works is not backed by science, but instead tracks a person's lineage and simply determines whether they have a certain percentage of Native blood. Because of the continual decline, not only for Red Lake, but across the nation, concerns are on the rise for Native tribes. It is not a scientific thing. There's no DNA test or blood test to prove. It's based purely on what's on the tribal records before you. So if your parent is one half blood quantum and you only have one parent with blood, tribal blood, then you're one quarter. So it's basically cut in half any, every generation. Red Lake Nation leaders are currently gathering input from band members. This will help leaders decide whether or not to put forth a referendum vote to change the blood quantum requirements. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.